During pasteurization, the destruction of germs is measured in pasteurization units, which are also known as PUs. The required amount of PUs could be achieved with the utmost precision if there were no stops during pasteurization. The bottles could then be evenly brought to the right temperature and their target PU level thus achieved. Backups often occur on a filling line, however, and the tunnel pasteurizer stops. This causes the number of PUs to rise above the target value. In order to keep this increase to an absolute minimum, PU control is extremely important. The PU control unit from KHS is based on a mathematical model and knows when it has to heat or cool which zone in the tunnel pasteurizer for how long. In doing so, it perfectly adapts to the temperature behavior of the products and their containers. It thus ensures that the number of PUs stays within as low a tolerance range as possible and that a minimum PU value is reliably achieved. Let's take a look at this principle in more detail. The bottles travel upright on a conveyor belt through zones with different temperatures. At the beginning of a zone, they have fewer PUs than when they exit the zone. When a PU control unit adapts the temperature on a stop, it does so for the entire zone, and inevitably also for the bottles which have already achieved their minimum PU value. These thus have more PUs than necessary. Accordingly, there is a certain PU tolerance range, which largely depends on the volume of the container being processed. The reason for this is the convection flow during temperature regulation. Bottles with a large volume need more time for the temperature at the point of measurement to change. This physical principle cannot be suppressed. However, based on container measurements taken in the KHS laboratory, the KHS PU control unit computes the optimum zone temperatures. This results in a certain PU tolerance range. If 10 PUs are required, for example, during pasteurization, the product achieves a maximum upper tolerance limit of 18 PUs. If 100 PUs are needed, the upper tolerance limit is 180 PUs. The KHS PU control unit precisely calculates the product temperature for each container and, in as far as this is physically possible, predicts and regulates the temperatures of the individual zones with the aim of keeping the tolerance range as low as possible. KHS. Filling and packaging worldwide.